Welcome to this beautiful property. Big door, superb interiors. Wow, look at the drawing room. Love this thing on the walls. It just adds so much color, so much character to a property. The flooring is amazing. Everything, look at the walls, the fans, the switches. Everything is just fantastic. This is like what you find as the most top end in this size of 325 square yards. This is Defense Colony, by the way. One of the highest end properties you can find in Defense Colony is this. Let me take you through it. Come. Now look at this kitchen. Everything is just top end fantastic. All the fittings, like it says Heti chair, Heti ki fittings. You have chimney, hob, microwave, oven, everything fitted. Now look at the quality of fittings. Inox fittings inside, nice fancy trays underneath. Good storage. Everything fantastic. The, the wet area now is in a different direction. So it is here. Now say if you have a help or you are washing or whatever, the, the, the dirty stuff is already, it's like in the corner. You know, it's hidden from the main area. The main finish is very European. And I think this is the standard that Defense Colony deserves in this kind of a segment. There is also a very large area at the back of the kitchen here. You can use it to make it your utility area, put like a nice table chair, whatever, and you, you can have some grass on the walls and make it look very nice. Let me take you to the other areas of the house now. And now coming to the interiors of the common areas, look at this wooden ceiling and the light fittings which the builder has given in the middle. Looks amazing. Top notch, expensive work done by the builder. Now it has also this powder room which has grohe fittings for uh, the toilet, for the taps and all that. On the reverse side if we see, now this is a lounge. This is a lounge and this has again a stone clad wall to give a new color to the whole interiors. You could have like a very nice family lounge here or even a small dining if you don't want a family lounge. I can take you to the bedroom now. Amazing interiors of the bedroom. Now this has like something very, very different which is not there in most buildings. They've given some glass work or, or glass or whatever you call it. Some very nice paneling, some wooden, something metallic. Very good mixture, it looks royal, it looks, looks premium. Similar wardrobes, again very good quality wardrobes. And the wardrobes are by the way double. Half of it is there, half is in the bathroom. Uh, which is again very expensive kind of work the builder has done. Let me show you the bathroom attached to this. The entire walls, everything from bottom to top is, is like stone clad Italian marble walls. Very expensive work, very high end. Even the shower area, I mean, I would really love to have a shower in this kind of a thing. Maybe I'll have to go to a five-star hotel, but you don't have to if you have this kind of a property. The fittings are all grohe, very high end. I think they come with a 10-year warranty or something, but they probably never go bad. And on the other side now, we have the wardrobes that uh, add to the main wardrobes in the, uh, in, the, in the bedroom, basically. So let me show you that. So these are additional wardrobes to what you saw in the bedroom. Look at that. Some storage there and all soft clothes. Yeah, premium again. There's a small hook, you can hang something here. Come, let's go to the other bedroom. Again, very beautiful. They've given a wooden thing on the wall that makes it they look very, very beautiful and premium. Expensive looking, royal stuff, you know. Again, good wardrobes here. Again, there is a big wardrobe in the bathroom that I'm going to show you just now. But before that, look at the Look at the woodwork on the walls. Just adds so much color and character to the property. Yeah, I mean, everybody makes 
just nothing. They, they don't give any wall paneling. This guy has given it, which is superb. And now time for this next bathroom. Again, stone clad walls, fancy grow hair fittings, great shower area, good size wardrobes, and which is also in addition to the other wardrobes we saw. All in all, great quality stuff done here. Let me take you to the master now, which is the highlight of the property. Come. And now look at this master bedroom. Do you think you get this kind of size in 325 yards? This is more like the size of a 600 square yard bedroom. But since this builder only created three bedrooms, the other two are large enough, but this one he could just give a like a very, very large feel. This is not a 300 yard typical bath bedroom, but this bathroom is even better with wardrobes on both sides and a beautiful shower area, amazing fittings, again, all grow hair, marble clad walls. It is not just like the builder is putting in marble, but it's also like which marble, the combination of it, it gives a light feel and then like adds, everything just adds and, and becomes like that amazing bathroom and that adds to the whole property and stuff. I also want to show you quickly the aluminum windows that the builder has used. It's, it's very high quality, I really love this. So sometimes the builder won't provide like a net door. He's given it here, which looks amazing. And then these aluminum doors along with a balcony. Now this balcony runs all across the place in the, in the property. This is all WPC by the way, it's not wood, but it looks like wood, adds a very good look, but it, it doesn't like paid like wood and all that. It doesn't have those woodish problems. Now this balcony is in continuation. We started from there and if we continue, you'll see. This is like the biggest balcony you can get in this kind of a size. In the front, there is generally a very wide road and there is greenery. So although it is not a park facing or a greenery facing building, but the feel you get is quite nice. You can, you can hear the birds chirping and you can see how this entire thing comes out together so well. And this is the exclusive parking of the whole property. You get a very long private bay, private gate, unrestricted access. You can easily park two long cars like say an, a Mercedes E-Class or something, or maybe like two large cars and maybe one uh, average size sedan also. But I mean, if you keep it too very large, it's very, very comfortable. It's wide enough, it's long enough. And then you have also the parking outside the gate. You get to park behind, outside your gate. Nobody else can park uh, in that position. So in all, you easily have three. Maybe you can accommodate four cars exclusively with this first floor. So if you would like to buy a property like this or any other property, or if you have something to sell and you want it to be handled by a person like me, you can always get in touch with me. I'll be more than happy to help you. And I have some free resources. You can download those, get in touch with me, tell me how I can help you. And I'll be more than glad to help you out with that.